Hello. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. Hi, good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, welcome. Hola, Jonathan Stanley. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Estaba preguntando ahí por usted, ya que no lo vi ayer ni ayer. Dígame, dígame, teacher. Hola. Hola, teacher. Sí, estaba eh, preguntándome por qué será que no aparecía, porque no lo vi ayer. Ah, estuve eh, compromisos de trabajo, teacher. Oh. Andaba ahí por frontera de Chalate. Uh, ok. Uh -huh. Entonces, no, no logré conectarme, pero ni, ni de forma de oyente, no logré nada. Ah, oh, ok, entiendo. Pero aquí estamos ya, aquí estamos ya. Ok. Well, <clears throat> okay, let me show you the topic that we are going to see today okay i hope that all of you can see it this is class number 12. Hold on a second.
Okay, welcome to all of you. This is the topic for today. Uh, today is the class number 12. Our topic is the simple present versus the present continuous. So uh, in order to start this topic, we are going to make a review about the previous one. I'm going to stop sharing. Later on, I'm going to check out the attendance. Bien, en lo que llegan los demás, vamos a hacer el siguiente ejercicio para ir aprovechando el tiempo. Sí, les mostré este ejercicio, Turn this pair into future sentences. Do you remember that I showed you this exercise yesterday? ¿Se recuerdan que sí les mostré este ejercicio el día de ayer? Ok, espero que ya tengan la respuesta de cada una de las oraciones referentes a cada verbo. Ok, si ya la tienes, entonces, bueno, vamos a, a comparar ahí con los demás. Luego me gustaría que trabajásemos, por ejemplo, en esta parte para, para luego comparar. Acá ya tenemos el verbo y ya lo tenemos con la forma del B y el HNG. A lo que hace falta son la actividad que usted va a realizar. Ok, tienes que cinco o seis minutos para hacerlo en lo que llegan los demás para luego comenzar a pasar la lista de asistencia. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, sir. Teacher, I, I am driving to my home yet. Okay, be careful, sir. And as long as you yes. get to, to your home, you can uh, uh, turn on your camera. Okay, thank you. Okay. Maneje con precaución, caballero. Teacher number one, I am washes 
the dishes tomorrow. I am washing the dishes. Tera. ¿Cómo decimos para, para decir de lavar los trastos? Ah, ya la puse en que pensar. Teacher, no solo vamos a poner el, el, el verbo, ¿verdad? El verbo de complemento, ¿no? No, el verbo ya está, la actividad que usted va a realizar. Eso, la... el, por ejemplo, I am cooking my dinner tomorrow. You are cooking your dinner tomorrow, ok. It's ok? Yes. Yes, ok. The next, I am playing guitar tomorrow. I am visit, visiting to my grandma tomorrow. I'm going to a meeting tomorrow. I'm painting my house tomorrow. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, let us see if all of you finish. I'm going to stop sharing. Voy a dejar de compartir. Espero ya hayan finalizado. So, uh, I don't know if you took a screenshot. No sé si tomaron captura. Por lo que veo, quizás no. Yes, teacher. Ok, bueno. Quien no lo hizo. ¿Quién? Yo no puedo, teacher, pero lo, lo copié. ¿Y usted está desde su celular o desde una, un ordenador? Desde mi celular. ¿Y por qué no puedes? Porque el botón no, no le sirve. Ah, ok. Sí. Ok, perfecto. Debe de haber otra forma de, de cómo hacerlo. Depende He intentado, de... pero no puedo. Sí, depende del sistema que tenga, si es Android uh, o si es uh, iOS. 
Algunos solamente se les pasa la mano así, otros se toca. No necesariamente hay que pulsar los botones. Sí, pero no, no, lo, no lo he traveseado, pero, pero ah. sí lo, lo que estoy aquí. Se trata la manera de copiarlo bastante rápido para... Ok, perfecto. Just let me know if you already finished, please. Por favor, me van indicando si ya terminaron. Quienes no han conectado todavía no pueden ver la actividad. Estamos aprovechando al máximo el tiempo. So I'm, I'm going to leave it there and then I'm going to mention your name and you're going to tell me what do you have there. Lo voy a tener acá, luego van a participar cada uno eh, y me van a ir mencionando sus oraciones. Jamás van a ser iguales. ¿Puedo leer las mías, teacher? ¿Hola? ¿Puedo leer las mías? Lady? Yes, you can do it, Roxana. I am washing my car tomorrow. Ah, okay. I, am, I am cooking delicious soup, soup tomorrow. Okay. I play ball tomorrow. I am visiting family tomorrow. I am going to the beach tomorrow. I am painting my house tomorrow. Okay. Um, buenas. Thank you. Okay. Somebody else wants to do it. Vamos, vamos, vamos. Necesito que participen. Esta es la tercera semana de el módulo. So I invite you to participate. Do it, please. Me, teacher? Okay, go ahead, sir. Do it. Okay. I am washing my car tomorrow. I, I am cooking soup chicken tomorrow. I am playing soccer tomorrow. I am visit my wife tomorrow. I am going to uh, going to shore tomorrow. Okay. I am painting my house tomorrow. Okay. I'm painting. Somebody help, please. Teacher. Hola. I am washing my car tomorrow. I am cooking rice tomorrow. I am playing tennis tomorrow. I am busy visiting my friend tomorrow. I am going to the restaurant tomorrow. I am painting a picture. Okay. Teacher, por eso es la mía. Ok, Janet. I am washing my clothes. Clothes and tomorrow. She is cooking. Ah, todo <tose> tiene que decir uh, I, am my, I am cooking. Teacher. Ok, do it, do it. Es que yo las había hecho, pero usando el she, he. No, 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 porque ya tenemos ahí el, el pronombre. I am. Ok, I am. I am. Cookie. 
Okay. Tomorrow, I am playing in the yard tomorrow. I am visit the neighbor tomorrow. I am go to the park tomorrow. I am, y el último no sé qué es teacher paint. Painting. Pintar. Okay. Yes. I am painting my house tomorrow. Okay. Somebody else, can mass. Can mass. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. Ok, no sé qué sucede porque les he puesto el ejercicio, me han participado solamente algunos pero estoy en espera de los demás. Ese ejercicio lo puse al, desde el inicio para que aprovechemos el tiempo, pero veo que no me están respondiendo algunos. I don't know why. Teacher, buenas noches. Fíjese que a mí, yo no sé qué me pasa. Bueno, yo creo que es el tipo de teléfono que actualmente estoy usando. No me podía conectar, teacher. Hasta hace un momento lo pude... Me puede conectar y ahorita voy a realizar la actividad que acabo de ver que usted había puesto ahí, teacher. Perdóneme, es por eso que me participé. Okay. No hay problema. Para quienes no. A mí igual me gustó entrar. Ok, tranquilo. Para quienes vienen llegando, uh, what I need is that you complete this exercise. You are going to turn this verb into future verb. Lo que van a hacer es que con estos verbos. Vamos a crear oraciones en futuro usando el presente progresivo. Por ejemplo, la primera dice, I am watching. Usted va a poner la actividad que va a realizar mañana. Ya alguien dijo, I am watching my car tomorrow. Ok, entonces esa es la actividad. Lo que usted necesita hacer es simple, agregar una actividad acá. Teacher. Yo. <risa> I am watching. Le, le recomiendo watch a, a los que vienen llegando que hagan por favor una captura, please. Take a screenshot if you can do it. Candy. Hello, teacher. <risa> I am watching the teacher for tomorrow. I am cooking the cake for, for tomorrow. I am play, playing, is playing, verdad, teacher? Play? Play, play, playing. I play soccer for tomorrow. I am visiting my boy tomorrow. I am going to the gym tomorrow. I am painting my room tomorrow. Okay.
Well, I'm going to check up the the attendance now. Voy a revisar la asistencia en este momento. Okay, America Elizabeth, say hello, please. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Uh, Ana Iris. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, welcome. Uh, Blanca Esperanza. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, uh, Cecilia Maribel. Good evening, teacher. Present. Good evening. Edwin Alexis. Edwin Alfredo. Good evening, driving yet, but present okay. teacher. <laughs> okay, okay, no problem. Uh, Francisco. Bueno, ya Francisco ya no lo hemos visto. No sé qué le pasó a Francisco. Gabriela. Gaby. I'm here, teacher. Gaby. Giselle. I am here, teacher. Ok. Eh, Ingrid. Present. Okay, thank you. Eh, Ivania Liset. No nos acompaña. Jonathan, Don Jonathan. Present teacher. Don José Ernesto. A Don José Ernesto no lo hemos visto desde hace dos días también. No sé qué le está pasando, Don José Ernesto. Don José Luis. Present teacher. Ok, Karina. Karina Vanessa. No. Eh... Catherine Maricela. Present. Ok. Eh, Paola Jovel. Present teacher. Ok, is there Paola? Eh, let me see. Candy Natalie. Present teacher. Chair two. Eh, Mauricio. Present teacher. Mauricio Antonio está acá. Eh, Roxana. Present teacher. Ok. Elizabeth. Present teacher. Elizabeth. Sara. Present. Janet. Present teacher. Yesenia Lisset. Yesenia Lisset. Present teacher. Por ahí están. Yesenia. Jessica Beatriz. Jessica Beatriz. ¿No? Bueno, ya tiene varias fallas. No le hemos visto, no le hemos visto. 
Okay, for the ones that are already arrived right here to the class, I need to, I can buy two read your sentences. Okay, para los que acaban de entrar, por favor, necesito que me lean uh, la actividad que eh, pusieron ahí justamente en el espacio. Okay, who wants to do it? ¿Quién lo hace? ¿Quién lo hace? Teacher, I have a question. Tell me. Cuando nos pone actividades así, este nos, nos pone como un como un tachecito, o sea, eso de ella ya lo cumplió, ella ya lo hizo, o así. Generalmente voy viendo quiénes son los que van participando. ¿Sí? Ok. También llevo como un récord de quiénes son los que siempre participan y quiénes no lo hacen. Ok, teacher. Hay algunos que siempre tengo que estarlo llamando para que participen. Tengo otros que ellos lo hacen así, espontáneamente. La oportunidad está para todos. Entre más participas, más aprendes. So, I invite you to do it. Okay, who wants to do it? ¿Quién lo hace? ¿Quién lo hace? Uh, teacher. Tell me, don Jose. I am, I am washing my shoes tomorrow. I'm a cooking sushi tomorrow. I am playing PlayStation tomorrow. I am visiting a museum my, tomorrow. I'm going to my work tomorrow. And I am painting my office tomorrow. Okay, thank you. Somebody else wants to do it? ¿Quién más desea hacerlo? Giselle. Okay, teacher. I am watching TV tomorrow with my family and I am cooking um, I am cooking X tomorrow. I am playing a basketball tomorrow with my friend. And I visiting my father tomorrow. I am going to to the beach tomorrow with my friend. And I painting my my house tomorrow. Okay. Your teacher. Okay, do it. Uh, I am washing the garage tomorrow. I am cooking uh, the turkey. 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 ¿Cómo se dice? Eh, pavo. Turkey. Turkey tomorrow. Turkey. Ah, turkey. Okay. Uh, I am playing. Tennis tomorrow. I am visit, visiting uh, the grandmother tomorrow. I am going to the mall tomorrow. I am paint, painting at the door tomorrow. Okay.
Next. I am washing the dress tomorrow. I am cooking potato tomorrow. I am play, playing soccer tomorrow. I am visiting my grandma tomorrow. I am going to work tomorrow. Tomorrow. I am painting in my notebook tomorrow. Okay. Paula? Okay, teacher. I am washing the car tomorrow. I am cooking soap tomorrow. I am playing June the rope tomorrow. I am visiting, visiting my brother tomorrow. I am painting my house tomorrow. Okay, thank you. I'm going to stop sharing uh, and we are going to continue with next activities that we had to do today. So, um, let me do something here. I'm going to hold on second place. Okay, open the link and you can uh, do the activity right there. Por favor, abran el link. Ahí pueden hacer su actividad y ver su score. Ojo con las instrucciones. Take a look at the instructions, please.
Did you finish? Finally, so. Did you finish? Not yet? I finished it, too. Okay, okay. Finish. Okay.
Okay, time is over. Did you finish? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. What can you tell me about? Okay, let us continue then. Um, okay, let us start. Uh, who is the first person to arrive at your workplace? And the second question said, what is the first things you do when you get to your workplace? We had two different questions. The first one, who is the first person to arrive at your workplace? And the second one, what is the first things you do when you get to work, to your workplace? Okay, I need uh, you tell me. Okay, tell me, who wants to answer the first question? ¿Quién responde la primera? Hola, hola, hola. I don't know if the microphone is working properly because I'm not having your answer. What I need is like, Teacher. hello. The question is the first person to arrive at at workplace. Yes. Algo así. Yes. The first person is the security. Okay, the security is the is the first one to arrive to your workplace. Él es el primero en llegar, cierto, o se queda ahí ya está allí. I don't know. Mm. When I when I am in my work. My job, the security is, is in this place. Ah, okay. Yeah, the question is, who, who is the first to arrive? ¿Quién es el primero en llegar a su trabajo? A su lugar de trabajo. 
My boss. Okay, your boss. Okay, in your case, is your boss. What about the second question? ¿Qué hay sobre la segunda pregunta? Eh, la segunda puede poner otra vez, teacher. Yes. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. In my case, uh, the first person to arrive at my workplace is uh, to security. To security, and the first thing um, I do when I get my workplace, I open my agency. Oh, okay, okay, I got you. Thank you. Okay, somebody else, somebody else, please. Bueno, como no queremos así voluntario. Teacher. Okay, tell me. In my case, I to buy in my workplace six I am okay and and the second question what is the first thing you do when you get to workplace yes how do you say desactivar la alarma teacher deciding your alarm turn off turn off the alarm uh, I take two of the alarm. That is the first thing that you do as soon as you arrive. Yes, for sure. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Teacher, puedo leer mi participación? Okay, Roxana. Y luego Kendi, que tiene mano arriba. The first person to arrive is cleaning staff. El personal de limpieza será cleaning staff. The, the cleaning staff. Mm -hmm. Okay. And what about the okay. second question? The first thing I do is I uh, is have breakfast. Okay. Candy. The first person is uh, my boss and security. The security. Security. No, security. Security. Uh, security. Security. Okay, the security guard. Yes. And the other question is I am. My dad to the computer from a previous days. Oh, okay, thank you. Somebody else? Uh, me, teacher. Okay. The first to arrive is the gardener and the laundry staff. Uh, the next person to arrive is me. Oh, okay, you are the next. Okay. Oh, y la siguiente pregunta no la entiendo. Ok, se la digo. Dice, what is the first thing you do when you get to your workplace? ¿Cuál es la primera cosa que usted hace cuando llega a su área de trabajo, a su lugar de trabajo? Uh, the first thing I, I do when entering my workplace is to clean all the areas. Okay, to clean all the areas. Okay, thank you. Somebody else wants to say something about there. Hello, Ingrid. The first person to arrive. All right, all right. Uh, all right. At my my workplace is my boss. 
And the first thing I do when I get to work is turn on the computer. Okay, turn on the computer. Okay. Next. Who's next? Hello. America. You arrive at this day night. Yes. Um, who, who is the first person to arrive at your workplace? In my case, it's my boss. La segunda, solo la respuesta le voy a dar. Yes, only the answer. Okay. I thank God for everything safely. I great and clean my office before starting work. Okay. Teacher, a mí me faltaba la segunda. Me faltaba responder a la segunda porque no la había entendido, pero ya lo, lo, lo dijo ah, usted. Okay. You got to the message. Okay. The first thing I do when I get to my workplace is I give thanks a good with my with my boss and, and my compañeros, means Co-worker, co-worker. My co-worker. 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 Colleagues also, we can use it. Okay. The first thing that you do is just to sense God for the opportunity to have a job and to be there just in the morning. That is what you said, right? Okay. Janet? At my house, they feel the person to arrive. Arrive, arrive, arrive. Escríbanme, escríbanme, por favor, esa pronunciación. Arrive. Uh, arrive. Así como lo oyen, arrive. Okay. At my, uh, my house, they feel the person to arrive is the nanny. Okay, and the second one? When I had to work, the first thing I do is check my email. Okay. Somebody else? Me, teacher. Okay. Who is the first person to arrive at, at your workplace? The first person I see when I see when I get to work is the watchman and the orderly. What is the first thing you do when you get to your work workplace? The first thing I do when I get to work is mark my arrival time. Okay. Somebody else? Hello? The first person to arrive is the designer. Um, the first thing I do 
I go to each department to say hi and ask what activities uh, they carry out. Okay, thank you. Teacher, perdón, una pregunta. ¿Cómo se dice saludo? ¿Cuál es la pronunciación? So all the can, because if you, if I want to say, the first thing that I do is say hello, pero solo la palabra saludo son greeting y despedida son very well. Ah, okay. Gracias, teacher. But if you say, the first thing that I do is say hello to Pero si usted es el primero que llega, bueno, solo va a estar el vigilante. Al menos a él le va a decir, good morning, hello, how are you, and something like that, you know? Okay, teacher. Okay. Okay, let us continue then. Okay, we have the conversation right here. Listen to the teacher, read the conversation, then practice with the partner. So this conversation is between uh, Ryan and Raul. Okay, pay attention, please. Good, good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador? What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to workplace, to your workplace? What's the first things you do? I usually arrive up 6.30 a.m. And the first things I do is to check my email and you well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Okay, questions. If you have questions, let me know, please. Teacher. Hello, sir. Eh, lo último, no entiendo qué le dice en español. Okay. My first uh, activity is to the pick up the letter. No entiendo qué dice ahí en español. Okay, hold on a second. Está hablando de la parte de, de Ryan o de Raúl. Ryan, sí, de Ryan. Lo último que le dice, my first activity. Uh, my first activity is to pick up the letter. Mi primera actividad es como recoger la correspondencia. ¿Sí? Ok, teacher. Sí, Thank la you. palabra pick up significa uh, recoger, pasar por alguien. Si, si, if you are going to look for, for your sons or daughters, si vas a ir a traer a alguien al colegio, you say, I need to pick up. Uh, to pick up my sons or my daughter, ¿sí? Necesito pasar a traer a mi hijo o mi hija. Así funciona ese, ese verbo pick up, que aquí lo conocemos de otra manera relacionado a carros. Teacher, what is the difference in pick up and get? Mm. Uh, let, me, let me show you this. This is more specific. Este es más específico. Porque el, el get es como... Bueno, el principal eh, traducción sería como obtener. ¿Sí? Pero ah, claro, puede tener okay. muchos, eh, muchos significados dependiendo del contexto. Ok. Sí. Thank you. Ok. Teacher, ¿cómo se pronuncia esto? ¿Cuál, Janet? Ah, depend. It depends. It depends. Depends. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Okay. 
Ok, otro, otro. No? Ok, I'm going to read again. Lo voy a leer una vez más. Dice, good afternoon, Raúl. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador? What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What the first things you do? I usually arrive, arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email. And you? Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Ok, preguntas. El crear breakout room me está generando de cierta manera algunos inconvenientes porque a las personas que así no, no se conectan. Y luego dos o tres me están llamando eh, de, en auxilio y me dicen, mire, estoy solo. Entonces, eh, vamos a buscar alguna manera para que queden los oyentes quizás juntos. Y los no oyentes quizás eh, que se queden a, en otra sala para que no nos interfiera eso. Porque si alguien está de oyente, significa que está ocupadito por equipo y razones. And I need that all of you participate in this conversation. Ok. ¿Alguna otra pregunta que tenga, por favor, rapidito, antes de irnos al breakout room? Haga un screenshot, por favor. Y lo que no comprenda, por favorcito, me lo va diciendo para ayudarle lo más pronto posible. Question. Question. No, teacher. Estoy de oyente, pero por el momento sí puedo quedar con cualquier otra pareja. Sí puedo. Ah, ok, perfecto. Aunque esté de oyente. Sí, pero en algunos casos no es así. Sí, no siempre, pero ahora sí he podido participar un poquito más que otro día. Ok. Ok, let us uh, create the breakout room. Okay, please accept my invitation, please, please, please.
teacher. Hola, Roxana. No, solo yo estaba en el, en el room. Sí, ahorita lo, es que ahorita las estoy moviendo, pero se me salió antes. Pero, y ahorita ya no la veo acá. Y justamente tengo a alguien solo donde la iba a enviar. Acépteme la invitación, la voy a pasar a una sala. América. América, América, ya le había asignado una sala. Me metí, teacher, pero nadie se conectó. Yo he estado practicando sola y de igual manera, automáticamente me sacó de la sala y me cerró todo. Hasta ahorita logré meterme nuevamente a la clase. Sí. Ok, ahí le envié para que se, para que se una a la, a la sala 6. Aunque ya hay dos ahí, para ahí puede unirse.
Okay, who wants to start? Hello, hello. Mi pareja no respondió a mis llamados. Wow, wow. Ok, eso es lo que les dije al inicio. Uh, es bien complicado porque creo los, uh, las salas, luego voy, voy moviendo eh, y algunos no, me, no tienen paciencia para esperar que se les adjudique a alguien de otra sala porque a veces no se conectan. Paola, ¿me decía algo, Paola? Sí, teacher, yo le di a aceptar, pero eh, me decía conectando y no me cargó, teacher. Pero, Entonces, pero, ajá, yo, ajá, yo creo que es por la red o es mi teléfono, cualquiera de las dos. Pero sí le di a aceptar, teacher. Ok. Ok, who wants to do it? Me, teacher, okay. <laughs> with my partners, uh, Anairis. Okay, do it. Do you agree, Anairis? <laughs> do you agree? <laughs> Nos quedamos a media, pero aquí estoy. Quizás eh, comienzo, ¿verdad? Sí, yes. Okay. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador. What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What's, what's the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6, half a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email and you well i arrive at seven or seven and a half it depends on traffic my first activity is to pick up the letters okay thank you next next pair please I am participate with my partner Candy Natalia Sanchez. Okay, for the ones that, that didn't get uh, somebody out there, you can do it right here. Para los que no pudieron conectarse en el breakout room, eh, hay dos eh, personas disponibles, lo pueden hacer acá, por favor. Ok, inicio yo, Cecilia. Good afternoon, Raúl. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador. What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. It. What time? What time do you usually get to your workplace? What the first time you do? I usually arrive at six and thirty a.m. And the first thing I do is to check my email and you. Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick out the letter. Okay. Somebody else wants to do it? Teacher. Hello, sir. I wish read I wish read to read the conversation with my partner, Cecilia. 
Okay. We Cecilia. Cecilia. I am here. Okay, do it. Okay. You're Ryan and I am Raul. Okay. Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am playing a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador. What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the middle room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What's the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do is I check my email. And you? Well, I arrive at 7 or 7 and 30. It's, it depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Okay. Thank you, Cecilia. Okay, thank you. Janet. My parents is Gabriel. Yeah. Can you start? Oh, I. Okay. <laughs> Good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am playing a video conference. Oh, the conference with a new team in San Salvador? What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are meeting rally for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What's the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6, 30 I am. And the first thing I do see is check my email and you? Well, I arrive at seven o'clock or seven and thirty. It depends on traffic. My first activity in in to pick up the letters. Okay, thank you. Somebody else wants to do it. Got the teacher. Okay. Okay, good afternoon, Raul. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Ryan. Well, I am planning at the video conference. Oh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador? What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is. They are getting ready for the conference in the meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to the workplace? What's the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6.30 a.m. And the first thing I do, I do is to check my email. And you? Well, I arrive at 7 or 7.30. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letter. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, I'm going to just, well, I'm going to continue. Let me move forward. Okay, on the activity number three, we have a pair where getting paired and discuss the following question. We have two questions. Who gets earlier at, uh, at the workplace? And the second one, what is the topic Raul and his team are discussing in the conference? So based on the conversation you are going to discuss, with somebody else. I invite you to take on a screenshot in order that you can have the information and work on it. 
Ok, les invito a que hagan una captura. Ah, vamos a crear otra vez unas salas donde usted va a discutir con alguien la respuesta de esas dos preguntas. Y luego lo hacemos todos. Les estoy dando el tiempo para hacer la captura. Ok, I'm going to stop and I am going to create the breakout room. I'm going to switch people here. Five minutes, it is now. Five minutes is now. Okay, here we go. Please accept the invitation. Hola, Ceci. Hola, teacher. Estoy yo sola aquí en la sala. Eso veo, eso veo. Eh, déjeme moverle a alguien para acá rapidito, por favor. No se me, okay. me mandó en la sala.
Okay, welcome back. Let me see what you have uh, related with this activity. Okay, the question one said, who gets earlier at the workplace? Who wants to, to answer? The number one teacher, then we have Raul. Okay. And what about the second one? What is the topic Raul and Christina are discussing in the conference? They conference with the new team from San Salvador. Okay, okay. Somebody wants to give me... His or her answer. No. Pero es que hay, yo no entiendo, porque dice que cuál es el tema que, cuál es el tema que, Ra, el, que Raúl y su equipo discuten en la conferencia, pero en la conversación. It, it doesn't mention. Ok, let me go back. Okay, I'm sorry. Hold, Planning. Hold on a second. I'm going to show you again. Hold on, hold on a second, please. I don't know what is happening right here. I can see it. Hold in second place. Okay, I got it here. Uh, they are talking about the, the topic. Okay, you can get the information right here. I'm planning a video conference, uh, the conference with the new team in San Salvador. What is our team doing right now? They are getting ready for the conference in the middle room. But they never talk about any topic right here, right? They talk only. Hey, Hello? They are discussing about the first thing uh, they do when they get to the work. Yeah, it could be the main the main the main topic right there. But the main point of, of the conference maybe is not that one. It doesn't mention. Okay, I'm going to stop here. I'm going I need to show you the material. Okay, hold on a second, please.
Okay, hold on a second. Okay, I'm going to share a link. You are going to open. Okay, please uh, double click on it. Double click for power. As soon as you have it, tan pronto lo tenga, por favor. Uh, under the, the video. En la parte it's a video. A it's video it. and a conversation, teacher. Yes. Bad. Okay. Sí, pero bajo el video lo que quiero que le den clic es donde dice quiz. Dele clic. Okay. Ok, ahí le van, le van a aparecer cuatro preguntas. Yes. Tan pronto, tan pronto las tenga, le da play al vídeo, por favor. Y basado en el vídeo, usted va a ir respondiendo A, B o C. Do it now, please. Teacher, a mí me sale en español. Hola. A mí me sale en español. De veras. Sí. Mm, será por, bueno, mi compuesta en inglés. Pero si el link que le estoy direccionando es. Permítanme. Se lo voy a compartir una vez más. Quizás su máquina tiene la opción habilitada de traducir las páginas automáticamente. Eh, no. Okay, the one that I uh, have uh, the video, please, uh, you can play, uh, give play, listen, and then answer the question, please. Okay, teacher, I finish the activity. Oh, okay. Don Jose, pudo, pudo verlo en inglés or no? No, no. Eh, voy a revisar ahorita esto porque es la primera vez que me pasa. Ah, ok. Ok, let us do it. Now, please.
Finish, teacher. Okay. I can do it, teacher, and I finish. Hello? Puede hacerlo, ya, ya termino. Ok, ok. I finish, teacher. Ok. Finish, teacher. Ok. Finish it, Okay. Okay, hold in second place.
Okay, hold on a second. Give me a second, please. Okay, let us talk about the simple present and versus the present continuous. Okay, take a look at this. Excuse me. You Do. speak English? Which one are you going to use? Do. Ah, okay, do. Do you speak English? Okay, this one, right? Okay, yes. What about the next one? Let, let us see. Okay, what, what about here? I don't. I don't know. Where's Marta? What is the answer? I don't know. I don't know. I? Don't. I don't. Okay. What about this one? What? What's so funny? Why? Yeah. Why? You laughing? Why? Yes. Why? Why? Okay, tell me. Which one? This one, this one, this one. What are you? Which one? What? Are. Why are you laughing? Uh, why are you laughing? Okay, uh, now the question is, before you give me an answer, do you consider that this question is in simple present or present continuous? Uh, simple present, what is your sister do? Okay, let us try right here. You say, what is? Oh, no. <laughs> what does? Uh -huh. You got it, right? Ah, uh, third person. Okay, what about this one? Simple present, present continuous. I don't I don't want to go out in the rain okay but tell me if this sentence it is in simple present or present continuous present continuous yes uh, okay okay 
And what about right here? Which one I need to put there? Don't. Okay, and the last one. Simple present or present continuous? Simple present. Okay, and what about- Where are? Where are you come from? Where are you come from, Canada? Wow, why? No. Hold on a second, let me check out. Okay, let me go back, please. Okay, where? Where is? No, where are you? Come no, from? where are? Uh -huh, where are? That is the right one. Pero salió que falló. I don't know why. Where are you come from? Yes. Uh, but what about where do you? Yes. Uh, where do you come from? Where do you come from? Okay, we need to be careful about this. Okay, what about this? How much it costs to send a package to Canada? Which one I need, do I need here? How much is it cost to How send much? a package to Canada? Is. Is? Yes, how much is it cost? Hmm. Try to look for the action. Uh, is how much does it cost? Um, does. does. Because, yes, he, she, it. Okay, well, let me see the time that we have now. Okay, hold on a second. Uh, let me go back here in the room. We are so class to finish. Let us read this chart before we leave. Okay, right here you can see in your material how to use simple present versus present continuous. We use simple present for general information, routines, activities. For example, number one, I check my email every morning. He writes report about meetings. She audits inventories. They arrange meetings. Okay, right now I'm going to read this slide. We use present continue for ongoing action at the time of speaking. Example number one, I am planning a video conference. Number two, they are getting the documents ready. Number three, she is editing the information. And number four, the secretary is making a fun call. Okay, con esto podemos ver la diferencia entre el presente simple y el presente continuo. Solo tienes en la página número 32. And the last thing that we need to resolve is exercise number four. You are going to complete the sentences in present continuous. This one is going to be a homework for you. We are going to check it at the beginning tomorrow. So don't forget the number of the page. It's number 32. No olvide el número de la página, por favor. Es la página 32, ejercicio number four. Ahí lo tienes. Okay, voy a checar la asistencia otra vez. America. Present teacher. Okay. Good night. Good night. And uh, it is. Present teacher. Okay, thank you, Blanca.
Cecilia. Present teacher, good night. Edwin Alexis, good night. Edwin Ale Alexis. Present teacher. Okay, sir. Eh, Edwin Alfredo. Present, good night. Okay, good night, Francisco. Gabriela. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Giselle, Gisela. Gisela. I am here. Okay, thank you. Uh, Ingrid. Say hello, Ingrid, if you are there. Ivani Alicet. Jonathan. Present teacher and good night. Good night, Jose Ernesto. Don Jose Ernesto. Eh, Don Jose Luis. Present. Karina Vanessa. Thank you, Karina. Karina. Katherine. Present. Okay, Paola. Present teacher. Natalie. Present teacher. Okay, Mauricio. Karina Vanessa no me respondió, cierto. Okay, uh, Mauricio Antonio. Roxana Álvarez. Present teacher. Roxana Elizabeth, thank you. Present teacher. Okay, Sara. Present teacher. Okay, Janet. Present teacher. Yesenia. Present teacher. Okay, Jessica Beatriz. Bueno, no se presentó. Okay, uh, don't forget to continue doing your activities in the platform. No se les olvide continuar haciendo sus actividades en la plataforma, por favor. Quienes no han completado aún el midterm exam, hacerlo, ya que eh, era justamente para la semana anterior. Okay, thank you, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Good night. Take care. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Bye. Good night. Good night.